morning. Welcome back to Listen, I Have an Idea. It is day 10 of NaNoWriMo. Guys, we're officially a third of the way through the month. Can you believe it? How are you guys doing? Are you meeting your word goals? Let me know how you're doing down below. I'd love to hear. Aside from making the videos and posting them, I really haven't been on social media much to, to find out. I haven't even really turned up to my my local NaNoWriMo group. Today, we are jumping back into the story. I have a lot of work that I want to get done. I am working myself up to a 5K to 10K word day. I don't know when it's going to be. Maybe Maybe Friday. We'll have to see. But I want to get as much written as possible. What would actually be really nice, and I was thinking about it quite extensively yesterday, is if I could continue writing the 50,000 words, but just in my second draft. So I'm scrapping all the original words, but make up for it. And my new draft is now 50,000 words. It's going to take a lot of work. I'd have 20 days left to do, well, 21 including today, to write 50,000 words. I don't know if I'm going to really pushed myself to do it, but it was a thought that I had, a very intrusive thought, might I add. Moving on from that, today I am just going to continue writing. I'm going to start right at the very beginning of the story. Last night before I went to bed, I actually had an idea for a little bit of dialogue, and I knew that if I went to bed without writing it down, I would forget. So I wrote that down, I wrote it on my phone, and I copied it into Scrivener, and that worked out to be, where is it? Uh, I have it right there. Um, 324 words total. So that is a pretty good start. The conversation is going to take place a lot later in the book, but I could just hear it and I knew I needed to write it down because I knew this is something that I'm going to include later on. Uh, I'm just going to jump into it. Let's go. I have organized my Scrivener a little bit. I've renamed all of my original first draft chapters and I figure it is time to start anew. Second draft, chapter one. And we're going to move it right to the very front and we'll ignore all the rest. Actually, I'm going to move this right in between too. This is just a whole bunch of random conversations that I had planned out and I just kind of popped them into a folder or into a text document because they're conversations that we'll be using later. I've been working on the prologue and I've gotten a thousand and seven words done so far, but I'm going to take a break because I know that Lizzie wants to go for a walk. That's right, Liz. You wish to go for a walk. So yes, that's what we're going to do. Uh, but before I go, I'm going to plug these words into the NaNoWriMo website. There we go. 1,007 words. I finally set the daily goal, though, for like my session target to the 1667 because I just had it at zero before. But I wanted to add it in there that way I could actually see my progress. All right. So 1007. Feeling pretty good about it so far. And let's update it. There we go. For some reason, I feel like this word count is off. It is. This word count is off by one word. So the next time I go to update it, I'm going to minus my word count by one. <laughs> that way, those numbers start to match up. I'm going to go for a walk. Come on, let's go for a walk. What is this? You were so excited earlier. Come on. There we go. Oh, squirrel. I see squirrel. Do you see squirrel? Ready to turn around again? Yeah? Are we here? Yes, we are. Okay. Let's turn around. No it's coming. Great. It is a beautiful day to be out for a walk. And there goes the FedEx truck. No. 759 words. That should about do it for right now. Let's add them in. 759, feeling good about it. And there we go, made the daily word count for today. I know we had a big day yesterday, but I was looking at this earlier and man, I thought today was the 1800 word, or sorry, 18,000 word day. But no, I'm pretty much almost ahead of where we're supposed to be for tomorrow. Or actually I am ahead of where we're supposed to be for tomorrow. It is much later. I have taken quite a few breaks from my writing today, but I just crossed over that 1700 word mark for the day. I'm thinking I'm going to take another break for now. I'm going to go to the gym tonight and then maybe come back at it later. I was listening to a couple of songs and they inspired me to write a couple of new scenes or more little bits of dialogue, which again are not going to be worked into the first couple of chapters, but they will work later on in the book. 
I also have continued working on the first chapter, which is not technically going to be chapter one. It is a prologue. The idea came to me as I was going through all the different chapter notes. Um, and I just found that I needed to write a little bit of that background history just due to the fact that I'm introducing a new character who needs a little bit more of a backstory to them. So I feel like a prologue would be the perfect spot to slot that in. That is not yet finished. I'm trying to piece a couple of the individual scenes that I wrote for that prologue together and then we'll see where we end up with that. But for now, I'm over the daily word goal and that's all I'm happy with. I'm home from the gym. I'm quite tired. My legs hurt quite a bit. I did about 40 minutes on the elliptical today and that was it. I was not feeling arms. I wasn't feeling legs after that. So yes, I am back. I am home. Since I've already hit the word goal for the day, I have decided I'm just going to call it quits. I'll pick it back up tomorrow. I have quite a busy day planned tomorrow, so all my writing will be done in the morning. But yeah, we're going to end it here for today. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you tomorrow for the busy day. Uh, until then, happy writing. Bye. So precious. Hello. Hiya.